everyone, and welcome back to Fantasy Life. In the last episode, we returned in our stars for the woodcutter, and then we became a carpenter, and this little girl standing next to me is Poppy, Woody's sister, who is the master. So she's having us, well, actually, the um, furniture owner wants us to build this custom chair. So we're going to go get materials for it. Hello, shopkeeper. Welcome to Fine Woods and Leather. How can I help you? Oh, Poppy, how are you doing? It's been a while. And who's your friend here? Oh, this is Mina. Only the next great carpenter in Riviera. Thanks for the vote of confidence, kid. Just kidding. Hey! But Amina here is Woody's new pupil, and she's helping him craft a special chair. Ah, is that so? Well, that's... Let's have a look at the craft, shall we? Oh, goodness. Marmimos. I'm going to say that every time, because I have no idea. Custom wooden chair? This really takes me back. Yes, I was hoping you'd have heard of it. So, do you have the materials we need to get started? I'm afraid not. Some of them are far, fairly exotic. I don't even know where to get beaver beam. Beaver beam? A lot of Marmio's crafts were specialized like this. You have to work. You have your work cut out for you. However, I do recall whenever Marmio made this chair, he would always stock on, on oak beams. I'm not really sure how he used them, but if you have some oak beams, they're on the house. Oh, if you like some, really? Thanks! Of course! Think nothing of it. You two have an awakened some pleasant memories for me today. Uh, thanks! Now we have three. As for the beaver beams, perhaps you can track down someone else who used to help Marmio? Someone else who used to help Grandpa? Hmm. As for the dandelion cotton, well, that's common enough around here. Try asking a tailor. Right, of course. We'll do that. Thank you. So we need to find another one of Grandpa's old associates. I'm not sure where to begin. But at least the dandelion cotton shouldn't be easy enough to get. So let's start with that. My friend Taylor at Castle Chapel might be able to help us out. Good luck, you two. Come back anytime, Amina. Uh, sure, uh, I certainly will. Alright, so let's head over to the chapel and I will meet you guys there. Alrighty, so here we are. Hi, Taylor! Hey, Taylor! Hey, Poppy, what's up? And who's your friend? We've just met, actually. What is new pupil, you know? Anyway, we came here to ask you a tiny favor. So put on your tailoring hat, Taylor. But bet you've never heard that one before, eh? <sighs> oh, come on, Poppy. You can do better than that. Anyway, what do you need? Well, we're trying to reproduce one of Grandpa's old designs. It's a special chair. And apparently, we need some soft dandelions or something. Oh, you mean dandelion cotton, right? Can I take a look at that craft? Well, that's easy enough. I can make some make some up for you using dandelion puffs, no problem. You guys keep yourself busy. I'll be back with the materials in a few minutes. Okay. Mhm. Mm oh, I know. This was easy, fun game. First, pick a number between one between three and four hundred and thirty-eight. Got it. Um, that's kind of a big number to choose between, but, hmm. Alright, I got it. Now divide your number by ten. Uh, uh, let's see, um, okay, then spell that number out. Remember the third letter. Spell it out? Um... Uh, okay. 
Oh, we didn't even get to finish the game. It was it was an R. My number was um, 323, and so then I divided by 10. It was like 32. If math is correct, I don't do math very well in my head. <clears throat> okay, it's ready. Dandelion cotton. Thank you. Oh. We didn't even get to finish our game. Oh well, you're the best, Taylor. Uh, excuse me, guys, for a second. Hey! No! Get out of there! You silly little goober. Okay, back. Sorry about that, guys. So, how much do we owe you? Don't be silly, it's nothing. Aw, thanks a bunch! Now, to find some how to get our hands on some beaver beams. We need to find someone else who worked with Grandpa. And I'm stumped. He didn't talk about carpentry with any other people much. Although he talked to his pets all the time. Oh yeah? Beavy and Bevo? How are those little guys doing anyway? They're busy as ever. Cute little guys. Anyway, thanks for the material, Taylor. We're off. Come on, Amina. Let's head back to my place and plan our next move. Okay. Alright, so I will meet you guys back at their house. Well, um, we got in front of their house. Okay, Mina, say hello to Grandpa's pets. Beavy, Bevo, aren't they cute little puppies? Um, they're actually beavers. Oh, uh, I missed what they said. <laughs> Whoops. And these little doggies are so busy and surprisingly helpful with carpentry. Anyway, why don't you keep in company for a bit, Amina? I'm going to zip off and ask an expert about those beaver beams. Such a mystery, aren't they? Squeak, squeaky, squeaky! Yo! Um, sure. Oh, I need to talk to Beebe. Scritch, scritch. Hey, there, kid. Nice to meet you. Bebo, are you a carpenter? You're so young. Scritch, scritch, slap. What are you? What? You're expecting us to bark? Bebo, puppy thinks we're dogs. Ha! Ah. Pat, pat, scritter, scritter, screech. Oh, by the way, don't mind my brother here. Bebo, yeah. Sorry, all I can say in human is, is my name. Russell, Russell, skitter, skitter, squeech! So, he says it all the time. Does it bother you? Uh, Beavo! Don't answer that. Let's talk about beaver beans instead. Slap, 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 Russell. Yeah! We've come to the right place for those. Beavo! We were Marmol's helpers, you know? Cree, cree! Slap, scratch! Yeah, beaver beams are no biggie for us. Bevo! Just give us two oak beams. Uh, sure, that's pretty easy enough. Considering you got two of them for free. So, you got the oak beams we asked for. Scrape, scrape, paddle, paddle. Let me take a look at those. Bevo! Go for it, bro. Uh, hand it over the oak beams. Paddle, 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 stop. Alright, let's do this. Bevo, anything for Poppy. Nah, nah, nah. Scrape and bite, whittle away. Bevo! Crafting beans is beaver way. Choo, choo, choo. We'll gnaw these beams down until it's right. Bevo! Even if it takes us all night. Scrunch, scrunch. Tables and chairs need nice, strong wood. Bevo! We're telling you... You're telling me, bro. Let's do it up good. Scratch, slap, choo, choo. Let's, we're almost done. Let's finish strong. Bevo, we know you're tired of this song. Uh, it's Beaver Beam. They ate it. Step, step, scratch, scratch. How does it look? Bevo, nice, bro. Poppy will be so happy. Well, well, well. I haven't heard a song like that in quite a while. Scree, 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 scree! Mario, what are you doing here? 
Beaver, yeah! We totally missed you, bro! Hello, my furry friends. I missed you both dearly. How have you been? Paddle, paddle, slap. We're beaverific, as usual. How are you? Oh, fine, fine. Tell me, has Bobby figured out you're not dogs yet? Bevo, that's a negative, bro. Ha ha ha. Ah, sweet little Poppy. Oh, what's this? Another young carpenter. Why are you looking at me like that? It's like you've seen a ghost. Your voice sounds familiar. I assure you, I'm very real, although I've been traveling for quite some time. Ah, if only that were exciting as it sounds. Anyway, I must ask you a question. Do you like the scent of fresh sawdust? Log piles? New furniture? Yes. Yes, I do believe you can be the m have the makings of a fine carpenter. Of course, young as a young carpenter, you will need to, to, to tutelage ah, of great master. Do you know Woody? I do. He's already your master? Well, good for him. I'm glad to see he's cha challenging himself. Wait, this doesn't make sense. So, when I'm giving him that little pet talk down the chimney, he was mumbling in the general direction of someone? That must have been you. It was me. You're Amina, aren't you? Well, nice to meet you. I'm glad you've been spending a little time with my poppy. Well, it was good to meet you, but I've got to be on my way. See you around, kid. Scree, scree, scree. Hey, mommy. Have you said hello to Poppy yet? Yo. And have you had the chance to haunt Woody more? I'm afraid not, on both accounts. No time for family reunion at the moment. I mean, sure, I peeked on them both. Both of them, just to make sure that they're doing alright. But they both need to make their own way in the world. Feel things out for themselves. So I've decided to let them be for the time being. When the time is right, I'll intervene. Just not yet. A word of advice, Amina. You show a lot of promise, but there's always more to learn. You're still a sapling. And that's that. I'm afraid I don't have time for more visit right now. Farewell. Uh, bye. Slap, slap, scratch. Whoa, that was abrupt. Yo! Yeah, look at him go. Scree, scree, skitter. Good old Marmio. Bevo. Well, I just wish he didn't have to leave so soon. Whoa, are those what I think they are? I can't believe it. You got the beaver beams? But how? Beavy and Bevo made them? Well, that's weird. Since they're dogs and all. Hey, whatever. My little little doggies, good boys. Yeah, those pups always did have a weird way of helping Marmio. Uh, help, way of helping out Marmio. And I was always the one gluing my hands together and panicking. Ah, oh, the memories. It's funny though. Sometimes I feel like Grandpa's watching over me. It's like I actually hear his voice. It's really cr pretty creepy, to be honest. Well, whatever. Now that we've got those beams, let's hurry up and make that cozy chair. Gee, Poppy. Thanks for lending us sympathetic ear. Ah. Uh, Alright, so let's head back to the workshop. And let's put this chair together. Shouldn't be too difficult. Here we go. Oop, hey, 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 okay. All right, I suppose it's time we got on with it and made that chair. There's just one more technique you'll need. Furniture, yay! Wow, Woody, you really nailed that. It's like you weren't even nervous. Oh, really? I mean, uh, great. Now, where was I? Oh dear, I lost my space. Oh, your help! Oh man, I should have kept my mouth shut. 
But you know what? You are doing fine. Don't let my slip up knock off your course. Keep going. But, 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 but nothing. You've got this, Woody. Oh, you're right. I've really got to learn how to do this whole master thing eventually. So, this procedure isn't all that difficult from crafting a simple bean. That is to say, it's not easy per se, but... Ah, uh, oh heck. We've got, you've got the skills, kid. Now all you need to do is your... Avoid panicking. Uh, sure. I'll avoid panicking. Alright, so let's make this chair. <laughs> and go into furniture, custom chair. I love that it has a blue seat. A uh, blue seat. Alright, so let's go here to this one. And one, two, and three. Uh -huh. And one, two, three. And one, two, three. Sweet! And we made the chair. Yay! Alright, buddy, I made it! Hey, you pulled it off! Wow, amazing! You really did it! Yes, look at the level of detail in this carving. Grandpa Marmio himself would be impressed. Hey, Amina, ready to show off your work to Mr. Goodwood? Man, how did you guys know I was finished already? Unbelievable! You've really done it! This is a spectacular custom wooden chair. Uh, glad you liked it. Truly, it's more than I could have hoped for. Thank you. You're welcome. Oh, this really brings back memories. It's just like the one Grandpa showed me. It appears my initial uncertainty was misplaced. You have become a true artisan, friend. As a matter of fact, I will be happy to purchase any of your furniture crafts. See, come see me anytime. Sweet! And without further ado, here's your payment. You certainly earned it. Nice! $500 for a chair. Yay, Amina! Squeeze. Slap, slap. Amina, is that a blister on your hand? Bevo, looks like one, bro. The sign of a true carpenter. Uh. Oh, by the way, Woody, I was talking with Forrest, the woodcutter, and he said you went out to the forest to ask him for advice about your new student. Heh, <laughs> yeah, you got me. You didn't have to tell everyone, though. Aw, oh, I'm sorry. But I'm really proud of you for doing that. It shows you're taking your duty seriously. Oh, well, thank you. I, I guess. Anyway, it's time to tally up the score for Amina. Let's see how I do this again. And 100 stars! That was easy. Yay! Fledgling! Sweet! Wow! A lot of new stuff. Uh, cool! You're a real carpenter now. Congratulations! And you're a real master now. Congratulations! Not to take away from your fine craft or that chair, kid. That's a nice piece of work. Ho oh, ho! Being a ghost is way too much fun. God, that voice again, it's haunting me! Although, for some reason, it seems to... to compliment or encourage me. Maybe it's okay. Anyway, never mind that. Listen up, Amina. You'll need to report back to me periodically if you want to advance as a carpenter. As your master, it still feels weird to say that. I can't wait to see how your life goes. Good luck! Yay! Fledgling Carpenter! Completed! Well now! Hi, Sawyer! I truly can't believe you were able to make one of Marmio's legendary crafts on your first try. You've got potential, kid. Stick with this life, you'll go far. Sweet! Oh, you got more to say. Hey, I've got a little something for you. I think you'll find you'll never have a, too many oak logs. 
Check out the marketplace for other kinds of materials. You're gonna need them. Oh, thanks! Hello there, Amina. How can I help you? Uh, let's chat. Congratulations, you're a real carpenter now. The more you produce, the more crafts you'll learn. You should probably start stocking up on materials. Mm, that's probably a good idea. What else do you say? Okay, I've got a little bit of advice for you. I know it's strange, but I'm feeling oddly confident right now. Don't rush while you're crafting. Pretty basic, right? But I see people making this mistake all the time. I know there's a timer right in your face, stressing you out. But if you want high quality items, just relax. Let the craft come to you. Accuracy counts. High quality weapons are more effective and high quality furniture sells for more dosh. Keep practicing, you'll get the hang of it. Upgrading your cell may help too. Uh, can help too. Good luck. Yes, upgrading your um, tools as you, you know, get to the next level totally helps. Like, so much. Alright, so we have the oak beams, oak wand, oak bow, and we have the oak rod, oak axe, oak saw. We might go ahead and make these. Um, let's see here. Yeah. Because it'll be better than the, um, the current ones we have. So, yeah. Uh, oops. So, well, sure, we'll just go ahead and make this one then. Alrighty, so I'll go here. And this one. And one, two, three. One, two, three. Alright, that was easy! Ta-da! Sweet! Yes! Top quality item! Awesome! Alright, so then let's go ahead and do the, um... Uh, the saw. Oh, I need some beams! Well, we gotta make a whole bunch anyway, so... Look at all that wood. Alright, so... Buzzsaw and choppy chop. There we go. Oh. I was like, oh, I'm done. No, I'm not. I forget it's five. Okay. Sweet. We should have made like extra this time. Yes. Made a total of four. Nice. Alright. Um, I'm going to make this a couple more times. And then we'll get started on the, um, saw. Alright, so let's make the, oops, um, oak saw. Yes, please. Alrighty. Hopefully I can do better than what I was doing earlier. There we go. Yeah, I don't know what the last, like, several of them that I was doing for the, uh, oak beams. I was doing terrible. Like, I was only getting, like, one extra. What? Eh. Oh, well. Alrighty. So, let's see what else we can craft. Uh, we can do a wooden crate. That's not so bad. Uh, ooh, a wooden cabinet. Uh, sure. We'll go ahead and do a wooden cabinet. And, oops. Wrong side. And then over here. In the middle. And the last one. Cool! Yay! Top quality item. Sweet. Alright, let's see. Maybe we'll go ahead and make the crates. What do we need for the rest of the materials? Let's see, we need fabric. Um, fabric. 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 So in order to do a lot of the furniture, we're gonna need fabric. Oh, we can do these. Cool. So let's go ahead and make the wardrobe. And so we'll go to this side first. Wow, whoops. Oh man. Okay, and then center. Here again. And all the way across. There we go. 
Uh, at least I'm getting good quality. I think I need to make some or more oak beams though. Hmm. Yep. Alright, so let's make some more of these. Alright, so let's go ahead and make the... Excuse me, oak beam. I mean, not the oak beam. The wooden crate. Oh my gosh, that uses the oak beams. Hmm. So, hammer. And saw. And hammer. And saw. And it would be cool if it was another hammer. So I equipped the oak saw already. And it, it's helping. It's kind of helping. Alright, so let's choose one more. And we'll go ahead and we'll do um, the wooden chest. Alright, I like it when it's all of them are there. So it's so much easier. And then these. And hammer. And top. Sweet! Cool! Alright! Cabinets... Uh, oh, right! We never even looked at the quests for this. Alright, so... Make three... Oh, I already did that one. Three oak beams. Excuse me. So we need an oak rod. Oak wand. Um, we need to make the wooden chair. Carpenter's choice... And then oak axe, oak bow, and we did the oak saw, mini masters, uh, wooden crate, oh, three, okay, that's not so bad, and then the bed, okay, that's not too hard at all, though in order to do the bed, we're going to have to become, well, what do we need for the bed, maybe we can actually buy it, uh, do, do, do. Alright, so let's go in here. Nope. So what do we need for the bed? Um, we just need three woven straw fabric. Okay, maybe we'll go ahead and... Oh, that's a high level. Hmm. This might be have to be last. Um, so I think... What I'm gonna do... Uh -oh. We can actually make this right now. Okay, so let's do this as our last one. And then... I'm going... To... I'm not sure what I'm... Ah! No! I can't talk and do this at the same time. Alright, hammering is easy. Cool! Alright, so I think we're gonna go sell... Uh, no. Bow wow. Bow wow. We're gonna go sell some of our stuff. Actually, you know, I think in the next episode we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna sell our stuff. Uh, some of the stuff we just made. Like the furniture. And then, uh, we'll buy some of the fabric that we need. And we'll finish off the stars. So, that's what we're gonna do in the next episode. So, I will see you guys then. And as always... Keep on smiling.